Like so many items that experience heavy usage, textbooks, paperback, and hardback books can fall into bad condition, disrepair, and quite often lose pages. Now there's a better, faster, and more cost-effective way to repair your damaged books. Introducing the Cover One Book Repair System. In only 10 minutes from start to back in use condition, this process can restore any size of damaged book with loose pages to better than it was brand new, and all for an average cost of only 25 cents per book. Hello, my name is Keith Wildy with Cover One, and thank you for viewing this video on how to repair loose pages in all of your books. And an added bonus is to rebind brand new paper and hardback books in your library in minutes for pennies where they never break again. Let's get started fixing books. The first book that we are going to do is a glued book, a paperback book. All of them are glued. I want to make note here that most hardback books today are also glued, i.e. Harry Potter. So you will want to follow the same process I'm doing here to repair this paperback for those types of books as this paperback itself. First step is to put the book broken or brand new in the machine. The machine automatically comes on. It'll beep at you after one minute at the end of one cycle. Most paperback books will take about one minute to do that. So leave it in the machine for one minute. What we're doing in this step is we're heating the publisher's glue of the book for one minute. Why are we doing that? In order to totally separate the pages from the spine of the book to where we can get my glue strip inside the spine of the book. Now we're going to remove the book after one minute. Take the book separate, divide in half, take a glue strip, cut it the exact width of the spine, three inches shorter than the length. Close the book up. At this point, the pages will be out of alignment, no worries. Once you put it back in the machine to remelt my glue and the, and the publisher's glue, you'll be able to realign the pages to make the book look brand new. We're heating the book up again to melt the glue strip within the spine of the book and we're also reheating the publisher's glue up. So at the end of the second cycle then, just take the book out, realign the pages, tap the sides and the top to line up the pages like it's brand new, then take the book and put it in the cooling slot which is the back slot of the machine to let cool for 10 minutes. At the end of the 10 minute cooling period, I'm going to take the book out and to show you how strong the newly repaired book is we just did, I'm going to open it up and show you that this book will never break again. The next book we're going to do is a stitched book. We're going to turn it into a glued book. You take the book. Take a sharp object, cut down the valley of the spine of the book, open the book to where the cover falls away from the pages of the book. You're going to take a glue strip and cut two pieces to completely fill up the width of the spine, three inches shorter than the length. Close the book, put it down in the machine for one, two, three, four minutes, which would be four cycles. Remove it from the heating uh, slot and put it in the cooling slot and let it cool for 10 minutes and you're done. Now that we have allowed this stitch book to cool for 10 minutes, we're going to remove it from the cooling slot and to demonstrate to you how strong this binding is now, I'm going to open the book, bend it back. Now the book is strong enough to handle the abuse of the student's backpacks and lockers. I want to show you one more example of a popular stitched book called Ripley's Believe It or Not. It could be Guinness Book of World Records also. As you can tell, this book is in very bad disrepair, which is very common. Very simple to repair. All you do is take the glue strip, cut just a small portion off, and we're cutting just a small portion off this book because there's no existing glue in the spine of this book. All you do is take the glue strip, and put it down in the spine, close it up, and this is a perfect example of the same process you would do to repair a textbook. 
put it down in the machine for seven, eight, nine, ten cycles to melt my glue in the spine. The reason why we're doing this book longer is the particle board that makes up the front and the back of this book is also in the spine. So we need to heat the in the machine longer. Take it out after seven, eight, nine cycles, put it down in the cooling slot and let it cool 10 minutes. And you're done. Thank you for watching this video on how to repair your loose pages in all your books. Whether they're bound brand new or broken, repair them in your library with the Cover One system where they never break again. You will find this to be very instrumental process within your library. Thank you. Discover what many schools, libraries, and institutions have learned about better book repair. Since starting in 1991, Thousands of Cover One systems have been sold worldwide. We can help you as well. And remember, Cover One is all about reuniting those loose pages with their original covers. For more information, you can call 1-800-881-1521 or visit us online at coverone.net.